They're lined up and ready for the kickoff, so let's go to the field for the start of the action. Number 14 is back and ready to put this one in the air. This one is fielded by McDonald. First so they have first and ten here. On the 20 yard line. Let's go now. Hey, watch the screen. Keep it up. Let's go. Lucky, lucky. Go make a play. Hey, hey, hey. Watch the play. Hand it off. George is there for the tackle. Nixon runs with passes, keeps the defense on. Just about a three-yard game. Ball on their own 23. Ball on the 23-yard line. Dropping back. Gets rid of it. He goes up and grabs it. Yeah, that's a tough catch to make. First, you got to get your hands in the ball. Then you got to try and protect yourself from getting knocked out by the defender. Third and inches. Ball on the 30-yard line. Let's go, be physical. Jensen, the man in motion. We turn it up. With the counter play. George is there for the tackle at the 37-yard line. They brought some extra people but couldn't stop him before he got the first. And run blitzing these guys isn't a bad idea because you know they like to run. you got to be sure to bring guys in the right place. If you think they might run to the outside, additional blitzers in the middle isn't going to help you much. He gets the carry. Number 30 is there on the stop at the 43-yard line. A successful running attack requires good blocking up front to be effective. Ball on their own 43. Ball on the 43-yard line. I'm coming through, baby. You got to believe it. It's RJ. On the team, team. Hey, let's go. Here we go. Pressure coming with the pass. It's batted away. He was in the right place at the right time, and that saved them from giving up a lot of yardage. Third and three. Ball on the 43 yard line. Let's go. Stay back Hey, watch that screen. On the ground. Keep the throttle nice down. Nice play fake. Gets the pass off. McDonald was the intended receiver on that play. Henson will come in now to punt it away. Number 82 will go back to accept this punt. From the 16. He's Rapham. Number 82 with some good moves and gets good yardage, bringing it back to the 27 yard line. First so they have first and 10 here. On the 27 yard line. Foley in the backfield. Ward goes in motion. They'll bring the play with the throw. This pass is incomplete. He's lucky he got that one off, John. The defense brought everyone on the blitz. And that's the idea. Bring the blitz and force him to throw before he wants to. Second and ten. Ball on the 27-yard line. They soft, man. We turn it up. Come on. With a counter play. Sarah is there on the stop at the 28-yard line. Right now, they need to keep going at the defense with a run. 
Sooner or later, they'll be able to break one for a big game. Third and nine. Ball on the 28-yard line. Foley, the lone back. Everything you've got. With the pass. Bradford is there for the tackle at the 33. Browning doesn't get enough to convert, and that brings up fourth down. Now here's the punt unit as the defense forces a three and out. Won't take a chance trying to return this one. Fair catch made at the 32-yard line. First Ball on their own 32. Ball on the 32-yard line. Watch your eyes. So low. So low. Only one man back. Watch the snap now. Get it, Get it in this direction. Harrison is there on the stop at the 40. You can't have a good running attack without blocking. But blocking alone won't get you what you need. You got to have a back who can find the holes when they're there. Ball on their own 40. Ball on the 40 yard line. Doug Malone setback with a counterplay. Harrison is there for the tackle at the 45-yard line. So he picks up about five on that run, moving the chains in the process. The line did a great job there of blocking the backside pursuit, which helped him get the first down. First and ten. First and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. Douglas, the deep back. Hands it off. Play action. Throwing. Andrews comes up to make the play at the 46-yard line. Passing on first down is a way of keeping the defense off balance. If you're successful, it could set up big runs on first down or any typical passing situation. Second and nine coming up here. From the start, from the start. Let's go, let's go. Denver comes out in their nickel pack. On the move. Fumble. The offense recovers its own fumble. Third and 15. Ball on the 39-yard line. The Broncos come out of the nickel package. Dropping back. Gets the pass off. Gets his hand on it. Great position and great reaction made that play happen. Number 29. Was there on the coverage. This punt will be his second of the day. From the 21. First and 10. It's the toss to the right. Ross comes up to make the play at the 25-yard line. I'll tell you, if you want to run outside the tackles, you have to seal off the inside and kick out the outside to have some kind of hole to run through. That just didn't happen on that play. Second Ball on their own 25. Ball on the 25-yard line. Stay home. Only one man in the backfield. Is there for the tackle at the 26. Foley battles his way forward for what appears to be a two yard pick. Third and nine. Ball on the 26 yard line. Oh, this is tough for you. 
The defense lines up in the nickel. Kent sends a man in motion. Pressure with the throw. Nearly intercepted. Deep throw, nearly picked off. When you've got a receiver who wins a lot of jump ball situations, you've got to throw it deep to him. That time, the defender got the better jump. Wiley is ready to pump this one away. McDonald looks like he's ready for the return. Fair catch called for. Hold on, we've got a penalty on the play, and let's check it out. Hold on, on the receiving team. Penalties and takeaways are just as big a factor in some games as effective offense. The team that stays mistake-free usually wins the game. First and ten. Ball on the 31-yard line. Don't stop, don't stop that motor. delay. Misses the tackle. Number 59 is there for the tackle at the 43. The defense just couldn't wrap him up. You know, the back did a heck of a job of running with some power. And that power allowed him to get a first down. First and 10. Ball on the 43 yard line. Number 17 with split backs. McDonald comes in motion. Draw play. Harrison comes up to make the play at the 47-yard line. So let's take a look at how this back compares to the opposition. Ball on their own 47. Ball on the 47-yard line. is there on the stop at the 46-yard line. Excellent run for a first down. They brought some extra heat with a blitz, but he was able to find some room and pick up the first. First and 10. What a play here. When you anticipate the snap count perfectly, this is what'll happen. I mean, he was into the backfield on top of the quarterback before he could even get the handoff. Hold the look. Watch the snap now. Do something, do something. You gotta believe it, it's our day. Blue game, blue game. With the pass, incomplete as the defender knocks it away. Well, that's just the kind of play they've come to expect from him. He always seems to make the big play just when they need him to. Third and 14. Ball on the 50-yard line. Here we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. The Broncos come out with three down linemen and seven defensive backs. Number 98 rushes through and takes him down behind the line of scrimmage. He's got a good mix of moves when he rushes. He can beat you with a swim, the club, or the arm over. So as we get set for the punt, let's take a look at our returner's stats. Number 82 sets up. Waiting for the punt. From the 14-yard line. Number 82. Turns this one to the 23-yard line. Ball on their own 23. Will start the drive at the 23-yard line. First and 10. This one is handed off. Ross comes up to make the play at the 27-yard line. This is a spot where you want to show the defense that they have to respect the running game. Gain of four. 
Ball on their own 27. Ball on the 27 yard line. Foley, the lone back. Handed off to the back. Davis is there for the tackle. Clipping on the offense. Number 74. Still the team has to down. show discipline and execute properly out there. If they don't, they'll find it's much harder to overcome the other team and get a win. And for the penalty, it's now Ball second and long. At the end of the first quarter, we're scoreless. And we're ready to start the second quarter. Ball on their own 15. Ball on the 15 yard Get it up! Block, block, block! Using split backs. Dropping back. Gets rid of it. Not the way. The Brady two was his intended target. Number, Number 56 at the coverage on the play. Receiver on the play. Third and long. Ball on the 15 yard line. How do you do it, man? How do you deeper than deeper? There we go. Drops back with the throw. Ooh, nearly picked off. When you talk about ball control and time of possession, that's not what you want to say. It's fourth and a mile, so out comes the punter. From the 50-yard line, McDonald with some good moves and gets good yardage, bringing it back to the 39. First and 10. They line up in the I formation. They give it to the halfback. Puts it on the ground. The lineman scoops it up. They got that one back. Second and four. Ball on the 33 yard line. Watch the snap now. Watch each other back. Watch the snap. Douglas lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Watch the hard count. Hand it off to the back. George is there on the stop at the 24. On the offense, number 78. The call is holding, and that'll push them back. That's what happens when your feet and your body get going in the wrong position. After the penalty, it's now second and long. On the 43 yard line. Hold the look. Watch your eyes. Douglas, the lone setback, looking to run it here. And is there for the tackle at the 42. He was looking for a place to run, but all those places were filled up with guys waiting to tackle him. On the third down, they have to get it to the 29-yard line for a first down. Denver comes out in their nickel package. He was hit just as he threw. This guy's so strong, he was able to get that pass away. Henson is trying to pin their offense inside the five. Andy signals for the fair catch. Inside their own 20. Foley in the backfield. Tosses it left. 
Number 49 is there for the tackle at the 10. You know, John, he always seems to be in perfect position to make a play. He's all about effort. His motor's always running at 100 percent. And he's got the experience to diagnose plays very quickly. Take second down and a long way to go. Crosses it out to the right. Number 56 comes up to make the play at the 14. This team's always trying to get a good mix of run and pass plays. As they get ready for this third down play, we'll take a look at how they've done today. The defense lines up in the nickel. Drops back. Fakes the throw with the pass. And he goes out at the 19-yard line. Ward caught it short of the first down mark. His third chance coming up here. From the 49. Hold on, we've got a penalty on the play, and let's check it out. Holding on the receiving team, number 30. The team with the most discipline is the team that doesn't commit stupid penalties, and they're the team that usually executes better. The lone back. Hand off to the tailback. Harrison is there for the tackle at the 46 yard line. Running the ball consistently is the first step in creating a balanced attack. Second and two coming up here. Is there on the stop at the 36. Great run there. That'll be a first down. He really ran well there. He gets some great blocks and he has patience as he picks up the first down. First so they have first and ten here. Hand it off. This one will be spotted at the 36 yard line. The tackle is his fifth of the game. Nothing doing that time, John, as the linebacker gets there quickly. He's one of those guys who's a sure tackler. He'll move up and play physically at the line, come on a blitz, and play the run just about as well as anyone on the defense. All right, let's go. Here we go, baby. Here the counter play. Slips the tackle. And comes up to make the play at the 34-yard line. Douglas runs it for about three on the counter play. On third down, they need to get it to the 26 to convert. Everything you got, get it up. Denver comes out in a dive package. They give it to the halfback. Armstrong is there on the stop. And that game will get them a fresh set of downs. It was a great run. He saw his blockers create some room for him, and he accelerated right through the hole. First and ten. Number 17 with a man in motion. A little misdirection. Number 59 is there for the tackle at the 24. A big part of this guy's running style is to use the blockers to set up his cut. But they were nowhere to be found on that run. It's second down and eight to go. For room. George comes up to make the play. I know they didn't get much, but it's all about making the defense respect the fact that you're willing to run. If they can get it to the 16-yard line, that would be a first down. 
On the call. Setting up play action. Rowing. Breaks away from the tackle. McGee is there on the stop. They've got something going here. Yeah, it's been one first down after another. They're putting together a nice looking drive here. Eight yards to the goal line. Ninth play of this drive. Almost at the two minute mark now. Only one man in the backfield. Eight is the magic number right now. Let's go. Hey, watch the screen. Let's go now. Watch the screen. Dropping back. Throwing a strike to the end zone. Caught. This is a good play by the offense in the red zone. The wide receiver is going to break away right here and come up with a catch and the touchdown. point attempt is good. Hey, as an offensive coach in this league, you're always making adjustments. And hopefully you can get the defense on its heels and get it in there for the touchdown. Good job by these guys. Clawson in to kick this one off. From the one yard line. They forced a three and out on the last series. So they have first and ten here. First and ten. Kent starts out of the shotgun. Pass play here on first down. And he can't hang on. He put the ball exactly where you want to put it. Receiver on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 22-yard line. Under pressure, incomplete. When you let the defense get into your backfield that quickly, bad things are going to happen to you. Third and ten. Ball on the 22-yard line. Foley, the lone back. Closing in. Sarah stops the clock there. The big man gets in there for a big sack. He's got a great combination of size and move. He won't be winning any races, but he's good at getting after the quarterback. And let me tell you, you never want him to be the guy falling on top of you. Very solid defensive effort to force the three and out. He's waving for the fair catch. Fair catch made at the 44-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 44-yard line. What's the hard count? The Broncos come out with three down linemen and seven defensive backs. Gets the pass off. Almost intercepted. Andrews with the coverage. Number 89, the intended receiver on the play. Second and 10. Ball on the 44-yard line. Area, area. There we go, baby. Rock and roll. The Broncos come out with one linebacker and several defensive backs. 
and he goes out of bounds at the 48 yard line. You talk about great concentration. Watch this. He's able to keep his feet in bounds, make the catch on a perfectly placed pass. And here's what they've been able to do so far on third down. Play to the left. Pushes off. Number 30 comes up to make the play. At the 16-yard line, Douglas, he's closing in on a 100 yards rushing. Some of these guys are like a train. They lower their head, keep their legs moving, and charge it straight ahead. Sometimes he'll even drag a defender 10 yards before he'll start slowing down. Down inside the 15. They got it into the end zone on their last red zone drive. George is there on the stop. And the 15 yard Douglas makes the ball on the counter. Short gain, about a yard. So it's second down now. And here's a chance for the offense to make their move. The defense could be sending a blitz. So I'd go with something to my running back. A swing pass or maybe even a screen. If they execute, they could put this one in the end zone. We're at the one-minute mark. Ball on the 15-yard line. Here we go, baby. Get it, son. Here we go. Keep it up. Come on. Looking upfield. Jefferson comes up to make the play. Douglas takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Third it's third eight. down, and they have to get oh, it to the six to pick up the first down. They've executed very well on third down so far, and that's a big reason why they're ahead at the moment. And the catch is made. Number 17 looks to be shaken up after that play, and we'll get you a report from the sideline when we get the information. Blossom comes in for the extra point. The extra point attempt is good. Excellent possession there, John, capped off by the touchdown. And right now they've given themselves a little room for error. They're moving the ball out there pretty easily. Every time I see these guys play, I'm very impressed by the players they have, especially on offense. But the thing that impresses me most is the coaching staff. They're always very well prepared. They do a good job of calling plays, and they're plays that are designed to take advantage of the other team's weaknesses. This one is taken by number 82. So the offense takes over. The last time they had the ball, they had a very tough time getting anything going. The Broncos will start the drive at the 20-yard line. First and 10. Fakes the throw. Rowing. Incomplete pass. We won the battle at the line of scrimmage and forced a bad throw. Every quarterback needs a little time to look over the field. There we saw a defense who wasn't given any time at all. Second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Let's go, let's go. Hey, Out of the shotgun. Pressure coming. Throws on the run. It's going the other way. The 10. And he's in for the score. The defense forces the turnover, gets it in for the touchdown. Blossom <laughs> comes in to attempt the point after. The extra point attempt is good. Here's a situation where the offense can make this negative a positive. The defense will probably be looking to jump another pack. So I wouldn't be surprised to see a stop and go route. 
with a good pump fake. And maybe they'll get a quick score of their own. Squib kick here from the 28. Series, they forced a bad pass and got the interception. Ball on their own 46. Out of the gun. Dropping back to pass on first down. Gets the pass off, drops the interception. He deflected it just in time to avert the completion. Second and ten. Ball on the 46 yard line. Kent spreads them out. The blitz is on. Incomplete, and, and he throws incomplete because he had major yeah, pressure. The corner came on a blitz, and he sprinted for the quarterback. Guys love the opportunity to get a sack, and that time he just missed taking him down. Third and ten, ball on the 46-yard line. The Broncos line up in a five-receiver set this time. With the throw. Leap from the wide receiver. The Broncos call a timeout. They have two remaining. Well, earlier we saw the injured player heading back to the locker room, and right now they don't know how serious it is, but his return in this game is doubtful. They'll pass on first down. Pressure gets the pass off. They're going to spot this one at the 38-yard line. And that tackle gives him three in the game. Kent stops the clock with that timeout. Snell will have to get a lot of leg into this one. Set up shot at the 45 yard line. Watch your eyes. Watch your we like the pressure. Dropping back to pass on first down. Gets rid of it. Almost picked off. And it will be an interference call on that play. The only question was it the defender or the receiver? Pass interference on the defense. Number 45. And they say the defender made contact with the receiver too early. The defender has to do a better job of reading the receiver's eyes here. So he can tell when the pass is coming. Ball on the 44-yard line. Will, Will, Will. Back it up, baby. Douglas, the lone back. Jensen comes in motion. Trying for the end zone before halftime. And he dropped it. At the end of two, the score is 21-0. As we take a look at his success returning kicks, we get ready for the kickoff. Clawson is just about ready to kick this one away. This one is fielded by number 82. The Broncos face an uphill battle as they begin this drive at the 20 yard line. It's first and 10. First and 10. 
They line up in the I formation. He'll pass on first down. Under pressure, going long. Nearly intercepted. He's back in his zone. He's reading. He sees the quarterback the whole way. And then he gets a chance at an interception. He just didn't finish the play. Ken has had some trouble moving the ball through the air so far. So let's turn to the chart for the story. Foley, the deep man. Here they come. Rosen. Missed tackle. Number 49 is there on the stop. Foley makes the catch but doesn't get very far. And that's what the mark of a solid defense is. They close in on you in a hurry and they don't miss tackle. Ball on their own 14. Ball on the 14 yard line. The Broncos line up in a five receiver set this time. Number 56 is the guy who dares to bring him down at the 25. Now, I don't know why you call a play that doesn't take your receiver past that first down marker. Problems moving the football today, failing to even get beyond midfield. From the 39. 35 yard run, return for a gain of four yards. They'll start the drive at the 43 yard line. First and ten. Split backs this time. Hand off on the draw. Number 29 comes up to make the play at the 45. The defense held their positions and didn't let them get very far. Two yard gain. Second and eight. Ball on the 45 yard line. Off to the tailback. Perry is there for the tackle with Perry. Midfield. Douglas is having an outstanding day with over 100 yards rushing. On third down, they have to get the ball to the 47 yard line for a first. Denver comes out in their nickel package. Hands it off to the back. Great fake. With the go pass, go and it's complete. Number 30 is there on the stop at the 44. This is good communication between the quarterback and his receiver to keep the chains moving. They know where the first down marker is, and they recognize the type of coverage the defense is playing. The ball is there, and so is the catch. not be busting off big game, but those linemen are really working hard down there. Second and eight. Ball on the 42-yard line. Only one man in the backfield. Looking for room. And is there on the stop at the 33. And he was able to create a lot of space on that run, John. Well, it started with some good blocking. And when he got through there, he turned up field, and they weren't in position to tackle him. First, First and 10. ten. Ball on the 33 yard line. Hey, score, score, score. Defense, get ready. Bring it. Tackle. the counter play. He's brought down behind the line for a short carry. Good play by the linebacker to get into the backfield and stop the play for no gain. I'll tell you, that comes from watching a lot of film and knowing the tendencies of the opponent. That was a heck of a play. Second and long. Ball on the 35-yard line. 
play football. It's showtime, baby. Only one man in the backfield. Throwing. And it's caught. And the fumble goes out of bounds. First and ten. Ball on the 22-yard line. Here we go. Only one man back. They give it to the halfback. They'll spot this one at the 19-yard line. It's three tackles so far for him today. Douglas takes advantage of a little daylight, picks up three yards. Eighth play of this drive. They're inside the 20. The last time they were down here, they scored a touchdown. Off to the tailback. Great move to get free. George Douglas comes up to make the play at the 18 yard, yard line. So a gain of about one. Third Ninth play of this run. They're threatening inside of the, the 20. 18 yard line. Slot, slot. Three shoot. Here we come. They have a big, big Let's lead. And they're on the move again inside the 20. With the pass, and he steps out of bounds at the nine-yard line. You talk about great concentration. Watch this. He's able to keep his feet in bounds, make the catch on a perfectly placed pass. Six points, bounce off his hands. He ran the perfect route, but when it came time to catch the ball, imperfection set in. Three minutes remaining in the quarter. Nine yard line. Nothing. They don't get nothing. Hey, watch the screen. Only one man back. Brooks sends a man in motion. We're talking about Brian. With a counter play. Number 59 is there on the stop. Douglas rumbles forward for a gain of four. They need five yards for a touchdown. Brooks spreads them out. Goes to the end zone. He's there. It looks like they could have run that one in if they wanted to. That's not usually the kind of defensive play that you expect to see down near the goal line. But they guessed pass and they guessed right. They just couldn't execute. Blossom comes in for the extra point. The point after is good. Perry accounted for the majority of their yardage on that long drive and led them into the end zone. When you can go to one guy and get that many yards on a single drive, that's pretty good. Lawson is back and ready to put this one in the air. Good distance. This one is taken by number 82. The offense couldn't get anything going on their last drive, going three and out. First and ten. First and ten. They line up in the I formation. Watch him in. Let's go. Keep going. Right. Comes up to make the play at the 20. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far.
Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20 yard line. A stretch! Can't out of the gun. With the throw. Ooh, nearly picked off. Brad was there on the coverage. Oh, the intended receiver on the play. Third and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Knock him out! Check it! The offense has had trouble moving the sticks on third down so far. Pass ball's incomplete. Denver fails once again to get the first down and that's seven times. Yeah, and that's huge for the defense to keep stepping up on third down like that. They're a solid group of guys who make key stops. Wiley comes into the game for the punt. McDonald into return. From the 46 yard line. 33 yard punt. Return for a gain of four yards. First and ten. Ball on the 50 yard line. Come on. Don't stop. Don't stop that motor. Denver comes out in their nickel package. With the pass, he finds his way. This one will be spotted at the 36-yard line. He's able to run down another ball carrier for the seventh time. He zips that pass in there and picks up a first down. Well, you look for the open guy in any play, but there is a progression. You look to your first guy, then your second, and so on. He did a nice job of going through the progression that time. Here we go. Yeah, you see me. Douglas, the deep back. Brooks with a man in motion. It's rid of it. Almost intercepted. McDonald was the one they were trying to get the ball to. And had the coverage on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. Will, Will, Will. Douglas, the lone back. Get it off. This one will be spotted at the 35-yard line. It's the fourth stop he's made today. Now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. On third down, they need to get it to the 26 to convert. Crockett, the lone setback. Closing in. This one falls incomplete. The quarterback will sometimes try to keep the ball low, keep it away from the defender, so only his receiver can catch it. I'm not sure if anybody could have caught that one. Number 89. Was the intended receiver on that play? Clawson needs to hit this one perfectly to have a chance. After the missed field goal, they're set to go on offense at the 42-yard line. A little misdirection. What is there on the stop at the 42? No gain on that play as the linebacker slipped in almost unnoticed. Yeah, he did a great job getting in there. He was looking for the run before they even snapped the ball. Ball on their own 42. Ball on the 42-yard line. Kent will work out of the shotgun. Rowing. The defenders got it. He anticipated that one perfectly, and he's right there for the interception. He's one of those guys who's always prepared. He watches film, studies plays, learns tendencies. Let me tell you, he's going to be one heck of a coach someday if that's what he wants to do.
following the interception it's now first and ten here comes the blitz with the throw drops the interception now who are they going to call a penalty on here pass interference on the defense number 56 so he pays for his aggressiveness. Yeah, the defender has to be careful to make sure he plays the ball rather than the receiver. First and ten. Ball on the 28-yard line. McDonald moves in motion. Let's go now. On the call. Jefferson is there for the tackle at the 24. And now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today. Ball on the 24-yard line. Ball on the 24-yard line. All right, let's go. Nickelback in this time. Drops back. Pressure coming. Rowing. Almost picked off. Pants with the coverage. Douglas, the intended receiver on the play. Third and seven. Ball on the 24 yard line. Everything you've got. The defense lines up in the nickel. Here we go, baby. Gets the pass off. Leap to the wide receiver. McGee is there for the tackle at the 21-yard line. Number 89 made the catch but was unable to get the first down. At the end of the third quarter, the score is the home team. 28, the Broncos. And we'll start the fourth quarter. So this will be a 39-yard field goal try. The try is good. Blossom in to kick this one off. Nice distance. This one is handled by number 82. It sure doesn't look like they're going to be able to come back in this one. But it's an issue of pride. They want to prove that they're better than they've played so far. They'll take over at the 20-yard line. First and 10. Spotted at the 20. He makes his fifth stop oh, of the game on that play. Foley takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20 yard line. Play hard and fast, baby. Come on. This side, this side. It's a blitz. Rowing. The wide receiver has it. Number 49 is there on the stop at the 30-yard line. Morrison didn't have much room to do anything with that one. Yeah, they had the coverage, and they made the sure play instead of trying something fancy, like going for the pick. Third, Third and inches. inches. Ball on the 30-yard line. Let's go, boys! Keep it up! This team has to start converting on third down if they're going to be successful. He hits his receiver. Number 56 takes him down at the 38. This is a guy who comes to play, and he seems to make big catches when they really need him. This time, they needed to convert on third down, and he's there for the reception and the first down. Let's ride, man. Let's go. Yeah, you see me. It's on. Stay on. He tucks it away. They're going to spot this one at the 40-yard line. He's in on that stop. It's put into a tackle number six.
Ball on their own 40. Ball on the 40 yard line. One back. Foley, the lone back. Pressure. They need some better blocking out of that offensive front. You have to use your hands, get them out in front of you, keep them inside, maintain leverage, and balance it. You need to hold those blocks and slow down the pass rush. They're looking now at third and long after the set. Only one man in the backfield. Going deep. Intercepted. He goes deep downfield and is lucky it's not picked off. That's one of those times when you see a guy make a great play in the ball but not come up with a catch. McDonald gets set for the return as we take a look at his numbers. They cannot get it going on offense, failing once again to even cross the 50 yard line. He signals for a fair catch. Fair catch made at the 34 yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 34 yard line. Let's go, be physical. Nothing. The Broncos come out in a nickel back. Tucks it away. Number 30 comes up to make the play at the 46-yard line. This is a great block. Watch here. He just barrels into the defender, taking him right off the turf. Now that is a textbook block right there. Number 89 goes in motion. Hand it off to the back. Jefferson is there for the tackle at the 45-yard line. He's showing a good burst and explosiveness on just about every carry. He's one of those guys who can break one for a touchdown anytime he touches the ball. Second and one. Ball on the 45-yard line. Hey, let's go one deep. They give it to the halfback. Harrison comes up to make the play at the 43. Just a simple run through the middle. Ball on the 43 yard line. Ball on the 43 yard line. From the start, from the start. Throws it. Ooh, nearly picked off. Number 89 was his Number intended 89, target. The intended receiver on the play. Second and 10. Ball on the 43 yard line. Check it. Let's go. Keep it up. They line up in the I formation. Here we go. Let's go. There's a flag on the field. And might have been offside. Offside. He provided the offense with some yardage there. Yeah, and sometimes these guys want to get off in the snap of the ball, and that time he just couldn't time it. He got called for offside. Ball on the 38-yard line. Here we go, baby. Deuce it, deuce it. He tucks it away. They'll go with a play fake. Gets rid of it. The wide receiver has it. Slips the tackle. Five. When you get this kind of execution, you got a great chance of making a big play. Watch it here as everyone takes care of their assignment. The pass is thrown where the receiver can make the best play in the ball. And it's six points. is good.
Quasim will be kicking off. That one is out of the end zone. But this is one of those situations where they're playing for respect. The game really hasn't gone the way they thought it would, but they have a lot of pride in their team. And I'd expect to see them keep fighting till that final whistle. First Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20 yard line. Watch out. It's showtime, baby. Get it on. Nothing. Ward, the motion man. Crosses it right. It's Gerald. Is there for the tackle. Forward. He's able to get a yard or two on the toss. It's second down and nine to go. Dimebacks in for this play. Dropping back. Gets the pass off. Number 49 is there on the stop at the 43. Perfect execution to get this first down. Look at it here. He knows how far they have to move the chain. And he gets it by making the right decision and laying it in there like that. This pass is incomplete. He appeared to feel the pressure there. So many passing attacks in the NFL rely on timing. When you can put pressure on the passer, you never give him a chance to get into a rhythm. And you force him to throw the ball before he wants to. Here are the numbers when it comes to third down conversions. I think this defense looks forward to these third down situations because they've been stopping them today. With the throw. Pass ball is incomplete. Denver comes up short on third down, and that's been the recurring theme here today. They're just not getting into good third down situations, which means that they have problems on first and second down. Still no movement into enemy territory by the offense, so out they come to punt. Fair catch. Fair catch made at the 14-yard line. Inside their own 20. Ball on the 14 yard line. Play hard and fast, baby. Over to the right. Let's go now. Yeah, you see me. Hand off to the tailback. Missed tackle. Douglas Douglas takes it up the middle for a yard or two. One yard gain on the play. Ball on their own 16. Ball on the 16 yard line. Hold the look. You can't stop me. Here we go. Huh. My screen. Here uh -huh. we go, baby. Rock and roll. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I'm coming through, baby. Hey, let's go. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Let's go, D. Let's go. Uh -huh. From the start. From the start. Uh -huh. Lucky, lucky. Uh -huh. Bridget. Uh -huh. Nothing. Uh -huh. I don't get nothing. Looking to run it here. Uh -huh. Spins away from the tackle. The 30, the 40. They're going to spot this one at the 44-yard line. He stopped him there, and according to our numbers, that's tackle number six for him. Big yardage there, John. I can't figure out whether it was more the result of a great play call or bad defense. I think that there's a little bit of both. Obviously, he's a threat anytime he has the ball, but the defense misplayed that one a little bit, too. Both of those factors contributed to that big play. Only one man back. Hand it off. It's free. The offense recovers its own fumble. Right. 
Two minute warning coming up. Ball on the 49 yard line. Get it, Tom. Not today. It's all. No, no, big time. Two minutes to go. Ball on the 49 yard line. The goal from the I formation. Watch the snap, Bob. He tucks it away. And is there for the tackle at the 46. He's dominated out there in this one. He told me this week at practice that he was going to have a big game. And he's really shown us that big playability. Third down. They have to get it to the 34-yard line for a first. Consistent success on third down, which they've had, usually translates into a win. Fourth down, upcoming as they opt to run the ball to keep the clock moving. And that's a smart call. The last thing you want to do in this kind of situation is to force some kind of throw that will give them the ball back. Keeping the clock moving is their best option there. Boston needs to put everything he has into this one. one of those guys who really works hard at what he does. And you can see that hard work paying off when you make a kick like this one. The kick sails out of the end zone. The Broncos will start the drive from the 20-yard line. First Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20-yard line. Let's go. Nickelback in this time. Come on. They'll pass on first down. Closing in. Rowing. This pass is incomplete. Second and ten. Ball on the twenty yard line. Down and right. Here we go, baby. Rock and roll. Mullen goes hey, go. to work with an empty backfield. Pressure coming with the throw. Incomplete. He threw it a little too soon and it missed the mark. The pass rush almost got to him. I don't think he ever had a chance to set his feet. I'll tell you one thing. This defensive coach sure has his defensive lineman pumped up. Third and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Turn over, baby. Blue down, blue down. Watch the play. Set nothing deep. Drops back. Gets rid of it. Number 49. Brings him down before he can reach the marker. And it looks like they're going to go with a no huddle. Dropping back to pass in this fourth and short situation. Knocked away. back into the game after being injured earlier. 
Jensen, the yeah, man in motion. Go. They soft, man. Watch the man. Watch screen. Back it up, baby. Tap it. Keep it up. Here we go. Here we go, baby. Hey, watch that screen. All day, baby. Come on. That's the end of the game. The final score is the home team. 41, the Broncos, Africa. This is Al Michaels with John Madden saying goodbye for EA Sports.